the JAMA Network. Some strains of human papillomavirus, or HPV, can cause cervical cancer and condyloma, also known as genital warts. One HPV vaccine is recommended to be given in three doses to protect girls and young women against both these illnesses. We wanted to see whether two doses would offer uh, equal protection or, or maybe better protection, and which dose would be the most effective to use in protection against condyloma. Dr. Lisa arnheim dahlstrom from the Karolinska Institute in Stockholm, Sweden, and co-authors examined healthcare data of more than a million girls and young women across Sweden. They were between the ages of 10 and 24. Researchers compared the occurrence of genital warts among those who received two or three doses of the vaccine. The best protection would be after having three doses um, compared to having two doses. However, we also see that two doses gives a substantial protection against condyloma. The study appears in JAMA, Journal of the American Medical Association. Even though we see in this study that three doses is optimal uh, and two doses also gives um, a, a good protection, uh, that doesn't mean we can translate that into what it means uh, for the protection against cervical cancer. Researchers looked at genital warts because they usually appear three to six months after infection. Cervical cancer can take up to a decade or more to develop. If you could reduce from three doses to two doses, that would really help, especially low-income countries, but also high-income countries, because the implementation of a vaccine program will probably run smoother. It could be less expensive and easier to administer using just two doses. However, protection was not quite as high as with the three doses. Researchers say for now, girls and young women should continue the recommended three-dose vaccine schedule. Catherine Dolph, The JAMA Report.